The following program contains no firearms, no scenes of hunting, no violence and no cruelty to animals. We do not promote hunting. All guns shown in this program are compressed air by spring, gas piston or PCP does not require a firearms license. The program is aimed to be informative, entertaining and sportive. So hi everyone, welcome back to our channel like I'm so happy to see you all again on another video. So today's video as you read the uh, title description like this is an unboxing video of a new rifle. The rifle which I have already made the review of the GM10 is the new GM10S which has been refined, redefined like upgraded from the previous one. So I'm so eager to see the rifle, use it, make a review of it. Of course I made the unboxing video of NX200, there have been a lot of questions for it. I haven't still posted the review video of it, so we'll be posting it soon as possible in the process of uh, editing the video, stuck up with some office work, so we'll post it soon as possible. Now, let's not waste time, let's do the unboxing of the new rifle. So here it is, the GM10S reached from Gandiva for me, and like now, as of now, we'll just do the comparison with the old GM10, I have it right now with me. So let's not waste time, start the unboxing of it. At first glance, when I just received the rifle, I was so happy with the packing of the rifle. Like there's not much to do about the packing, but it does matter when the rifle is shipped, right? So the packing was so good compared to the previous one, like kind of a different packing setup on the whole. And so I'll open it facing towards you. So comes with the foam padding on the top, put it away, yeah, comes with the owner's manual, contains information about safety, the operating instructions, filling of the rifle, loading and unloading, everything, so, and comes with the spec sheet, which gives about the specs detail of the rifle, this is a test target sheet, sent with the rifle like shot at the factory before dispatching the rifle i do get it with all the rifles sent from there they test it before sending it i got it with the previous gm10 too like it's a 10 shot group so i'm really impressed with this guys like see all the 10 shots have been into the same hole shot with the jsp match pellets okay i'm gonna give it a try with the jsp match pellets for sure i wish the accuracy continues to long ranges also so i'm so happy to see this like a really small group very small group over there one whole group with the 10 shots i'm happy with this like, i'm so eager after looking at the group <laughs> like how the rifle is going to perform some accessories with the rifle so there's a sample pellet box g smith super packed 8.5 grains must be about 50 pellets or something should be good for testing and then the rifle comes with a supplied in fill probe for filling the rifle and then there's the box the rifle operates on a 10 shot rotary magazine here it is the 10 shot rotary magazine i have already used it in the gym 10 a very good magazine indexes really well has a good stiff spring inside so indexes the pellet really well has a company emblem on the side let's keep it aside before taking on the rifle i just want to mention guys I'm really, really, really liking the stock of this rifle than the previous one. So, okay. We should go there. The stock really feels good. So nice to have a touch of it than the previous glossy one. Looks like the action has been taken out a little bit. Should be good backside has been pushed a little bit forward like it was placed over here the, in the previous one i had the previous one with me let's see both so here it is the gm10 and the gm10 s let's see what are the things upgraded changed for the gm10 s from the gm10 first step just taking a look at it i can see the stock has changed actually it has a glossy stock on the gm10 but right now the glossy effect has been taken off like a normal wood pattern is there like most of the people will love i really love the wooden stock in this one has a nice feel has a nice touch 
same kind of a rubber padding at the back and has a small cutout in the forehand as a small cutout in the forehand like you can slide your hand when you are shooting like for different positions like okay the main part of it the safety here it is the safety a uh, trigger blocking safety blocks the trigger when the safety is engaged the trigger guard has been changed the gm10 had a metal trigger guard a very simple one but this one is looking far more better i really love it another one important feature is like they have taken the action a little bit out like, like what advantage does it give like i really wanted it i really really wanted it because when you cock the rifle you can latch it over here see like you can put it back over here and you can put in the magazine like taking the single shot tray out putting in the magazine be a lot 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 easier than it was before so can't be done in the gm10 because like gm10 the stock is a little bit higher doesn't have this cut out like you can pull it back but it doesn't fall back into the place so what happens is like you have to pull it back hold it and then put the magazine inside like you need both the hands to do it but for now like i'm so comfortable i can load it put it back here and then insert the magazine start the process so i really love this rifle the rifle has been upgraded really well i'll give a close up look of this rifle at the end of this video stay tuned like i'll give a clean and clear close up look of the rifle you can be able to see the rifle like more clear than what i showed right now i'm so happy the even the rear sight has been pushed a little bit forward because the open sight users like should have mentioned about it so the company has taken into consideration like it's a really good thing when the com company takes the user suggestion considers them and makes the modifications like that's what the customers need like i am so happy with the product so eager to test this product out have to go through some different varieties of pellets test this rifle at different ranges tune up the rifle for my shooting get used with the rifle and we'll post a clean and clear detailed review of this rifle soon as possible so stay tuned hope you like the unboxing video of this i have a couple of videos coming soon as possible I have eco shot targets sent from the factory to be tested yet to test them out i am in the process of making a video so we'll be posting them soon as possible within a couple of days good targets for fun shooting for long range shooting i mean like they are really good guys like i post the video within a couple of days and then i have the nx200 review coming up like i have a couple of videos lined up so stay tuned for more videos see you in the next one bye bye Thank you.